this is uh, fresh racing here it's my first ever video I just um, I wanted to make a make a little video about this entire race week and everything that's going on I guess it's gonna be considered my first video but um, yeah so let's talk about what what went on this entire week first of all we went off with the clash and uh it was it was all right i mean there was some good racing going on but um nothing really that i didn't expect you know joe gonna won and uh, it, i mean he you know the whole thing that went on with Denny Hamlin Kozlowski was I don't know it's just fucking racing I guess you could say first of all if if you're gonna subscribe to me I do curse a lot so uh, I would suggest if you're not uh, 18 then or I guess I don't know all this whole YouTube demonetization shit I don't want to immediately get you know screwed by YouTube on my first video so I do curse a lot and I do drink and I do whatever so if you don't want to subscribe to me then that's fine because I am very crude but anyway let's get back to the uh, racing thing I just I'll, I'll talk to my, I'll talk about myself a little bit later um, yeah this I don't know this whole format thing that's going on is, is pretty interesting but Joe Logano won the clash and that happened and yeah that's over with now so basically what else happened uh, Oh yeah, the Arca, Arca race happened. I don't even. I think it was like Terrio that won that or some sh some shit. I don't even remember somebody that won that, and it was it was pretty good actually compared to some of the other races that I'm about to talk about. It was not fucking bad. It was a pretty damn good race, and I don't know. I, I uh, and then the uh, let me think. The qualifying happened after the Arca, and that was. You know, you expected to get Chase and Junior up there on the pole. I mean, I, I was wanting Clint to get up there, of course, but that didn't happen. He ended up getting like six after the duels and all that. And um, let me let me think. I I don't see. I was I was so fucking drunk that I don't even remember the duels. So I don't know. I mean, that's just the fucking qualifying. Basically, the duels are the qualifying nowadays. So, I don't know. Uh, in the truck race, the truck race, that's the one that was very memorable for me. Because after all, the, you know, the whole Matt Crafton thing, and then it was just constant, just wrecking back and forth, back and forth. And of course, you know, I'm from Kentucky, so I was pulling for Ben Rhodes, of course. Which a lot of people probably disagree with me. You know, he's he he might have caused. I he, I mean, I th I I think he got spun out in that last couple laps. But it's it's whatever y'all's opinion are. I don't care. I'd like to hear in the comments to know what y'all's opinion are about the whole Matt Crafton, Ben Rhodes, you know, all that. But yeah, he's he's a fucking good racer, man. I don't know. I like the dude, and uh, but. But uh, a, a lot of fucking, I don't know, there wasn't a lot of drama that really took place throughout the entire weekend as far as like, you know, people getting mad at each other. It was just, it was constant fucking just accidents. It was accidents, loose race cars throughout the entire weekend. You know, people were trying to bump draft. The truck race, they were actually able to bump draft. But, I mean, <laughs> the Xfinity... I mean, I see. I don't see how Ryan Reed won that shit, but those those little tiny ass pullers that they added up to the cars this year, it's like, why would they even fucking add that? I don't really understand it. Like, I don't know. But I mean, you heard a little bit of, that Kozlowski complained about it, and he was fucking right. I mean, those you can't add these tiny ass spoilers with no rear downforce and expect to be able to bump draft at super speedways. But yeah, I'm glad that uh, Ryan Reed got his win in the Xfinity series, and uh, you know that was that was a killer finish. I'm sorry, like I, I saw him do like a rookie move, like I, I don't know, I think it was like 30 laps to go or something like that, and I was like, oh, you 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 know you're done. But then he he managed to get his way back at the end, and somehow made his way back and want the fucking race again so so props to ron reed for real for real
All right, so the Daytona 500, I mean, all those other races that, that led back, I mean, race week was pretty damn good, if you think about it. I mean, it, they they had some some good good cautions. I mean, not good cautions, fuck. What am I talking about? I hate commercials. Uh, they had some good wrecks and good racing throughout all of the entire race week. I mean, you got the Clash, you got the Duels, you got the Arca Race, you got the Trucks, you got the Xfinity, all that bullshit. I mean, it was fucking great, great racing throughout the entire week. Week, God, I said reek, but <laughs> yeah, this is my first fucking YouTube video, so bear with me. Uh, but <laughs> yeah, they, I mean, you you got what you expected from Daytona. I mean, come on, and I don't think we've seen racing like this for a while, and I think that a lot of people are gonna enjoy it. But yeah, let's talk about the Daytona 500. Good Lord, was that a hell of a race? Oh my god, uh, I mean, the first two stages, I don't know, I mean, yeah, there was some good racing, don't get me wrong, you know, you had uh, my personal favorite, Jay McMurray, up there the entire time, and, uh, I mean, unfortunately, Clint Boyer got, you know, shuffled back there, and eventually got in a wreck, I don't know what Kyle Busch and all the Joe Gibbs guys were thinking throughout that entire race. Like, why would they even try to just sit there and group in a pack and lead the race? I mean, I guess they were, I understand that they were trying to not get a lap down, but why? I mean, like, when it causes your, your entire team to get on a wreck, why would you fucking just cause it? You know, I, I don't know. But accidents happen, it's fucking Daytona, so I can't blame the dude. And, I don't know, it was, it was some damn good racing. I don't know, man, it was just, it was a damn good race, and, uh, I really enjoyed the finish. And, I don't know, I mean, I feel like that, I mean, a lot of people are gonna say, oh, NASCAR's rigged because K Kurt Busch won or whatever, but... I mean, he had a fucking beat-up car, and there were so many people out by the end of that race that, I don't know, I mean, it was, it was a good race. I, I can't, I can't hate on it, you know, it was, it was what I, ex what I expected and what I wanted it to be, you know, and that's why I love NASCAR, and that's why I'm going to continue to do these videos, because I, I really enjoy the sport after, uh, especially after last year. I mean, I don't know why I didn't start making videos last year, but I don't know. Uh, yeah, uh, my name is Zach, and uh, this is my channel, Fresh Racing. And I, uh, I hope to see you guys. I hope that, you know, you guys actually like my content. This is my first video, so I really don't know what the hell I'm doing. So, um... Yeah, I, I, I'm going to, I'll get more in depth, you know, with the races and stuff, and I'll, I'll let you guys know what the hell's going on, you know, and I'll, I'll, I'll find out, I'll, I'll get more used to what I'm doing, and I'm sure I'm going to like it, because I, I love YouTube, and uh, I love NASCAR, and I don't know, I'm just going to try my best to keep doing, keep doing what I'm doing, so, uh, yeah, I hope you guys subscribe and comment with whatever. Give me advice. Let me know what the hell to do. Uh, yeah, peace. Subscribe to Fresh Racing. The Vagisil car has been itching and burning rubber all season out there.